welcome back to the channel. So, it's September, which means it is back to school this week. Have I done most of the work I need to do for then? No. Do I have any motivation this week to do it? No. But it needs to be done. So, we need to get our room sleeping caps on. And get to work, basically. I find that these videos really help me get motivated watching them so maybe me filming one will do the same thing that's my like hypothesis i've made a list i'm going to scooch over so you can see my list of everything i need to do um including like tidying my room getting my work done also like doing some self-care stuff so i'm mentally ready to go back to school uh because preparation for school is not just work so i'm going into year 13 which i'm absolutely terrified about I know it's going to be a fun year, I've got a lot of fun things happening this year, but I also know it's going to be a really busy year, so that's why I'm slightly panicking. Also there's a fly, but yeah, come on, let's get, let's get ready, let's get ready for my last year of sixth form. And my second year, so it's either your first year or your last year, so... There's so much more, more, so much more than I thought there was. I just need to do a little bit of shopping today. I've got a few little things I need to get. Not a lot, literally just some pens and a book, like a notebook. And that's it. That's all I need. Oh stop, it's like the cutest thing ever. got to me guys I'm so sorry here's my haul right now I've got what I needed I got my notebook um, I got my pens they're just some thick pens because that's all I need I also ended up getting a peel off face mask later and a bath bomb because self care now this thing right the Halloween section is out in like every shop locally now because it's September and obviously Halloween starts in September obviously guys go on now um look 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 I'm let me hear me out I just I really like clowns so I bought it for myself he's gonna look at that look at her go they look great you're not buying this are you but anyway, back to the video. In my defence, it looks cool. Okay then. Um. There we go. I should turn this on or if that's gonna help or not literally does nothing okay I'm in my comfy jumper um, I've got my face mask here and it's time for a little bit of self-care because I am panicking <laughs> most of my work's done now so that's good everybody give me a little round of applause thank you thank you thank you um, I've still got a little bit to do but I'll do it afterwards because we're chilling for the moment we're taking a breath this is the face mask if you're wondering. That smells really nice. 
Again, welcome to another episode of I Can't See Anything. This will probably be the last time I check in with you before the video ends. So, I thought I would just explain a little bit of like how I'm feeling for the new term. So, year 13 is the year I've kind of been thinking about basically my whole life as like the, like this is the, this is like, this is like the, the top point, this is like the place everybody wants to get to. It's like the most important part of my life. Because my whole life has very much been centred, unfortunately, around academics. Um, just kind of how like society makes you think, I suppose. So this is kind of like the year that's been the most anticipated in my mind. Like this is the year I've thought about the most for the longest time. Like ever since like year like five or whatever, I've been like, oh my god, I'm going to be taking my A levels, which is kind of a bit different. It's kind of different what I'm actually doing to what I thought I'd be doing because I'm obviously doing performance-based subjects. And like in the start of like I'll probably actually say like year four to be fair, and year five I was pretty much I still wanted to be an actor. But like I thought always thought I was going to be a marine biologist. Um, my family have kind of grown up caring about like the ocean and stuff. Um, this is kind of what I thought like naturally I thought I would do. Uh, I thought I was going to get these really great grades in science and stuff and I was going to take A levels in biology and chemistry and I was going to get these great amazing grades and I was going to go off to a great uni for science. That didn't happen. I ended up doing drama and music and performing arts which you could say is a little bit of like a, a u-turn but it was the right u-turn for me um, so I'm not complaining in the slightest for that. I can't see where I've put things on and where I've not. Sorry for being this close to you. So naturally, it's going to be a bad idea putting this down. So naturally, <laughs> why do I look like that? Um, naturally, this was kind of the time that I thought was going to be the most important time in my life. And it, it is very much still the most important part of my entire life. Um, which is obviously quite subjective like looking back on this time in the future I'll be like what are we talking about like this is definitely not the most important time of your life I don't know what, you know um, but that's what it feels like at the moment um, and that terrifies me I've got to do auditions for drama school which is like my dream and so this is kind of the point where it's like my dream is either gonna happen or it's not gonna happen and I don't know how to process that in my head because if it doesn't happen then cool logically like I can there's other ways I can be a performer there's other ways I can go about it there's more time but it just feels really final and I think that's what scares me I keep telling myself that I need to be thinking positively like I need to be thinking positively about like getting into courses I want to but there's also the side of me that needs to be realistic because if I'm idealizing this next year don't worry I've just got a random sock in my hand um <laughs> If I'm idealising this perfect next year in my head and then that doesn't happen, it's going to be more of a disappointment when I kind of make myself believe that it's definitely going to happen, you know? I want to try and I want to do so well this year. Um, I'm really excited is the other thing. I'm so, so excited for the projects we're doing this year. Some of the units in my classes are so fun and I want to be able to enjoy them. Like we're doing another pantomime and pantomime something I really really loved and enjoyed last year and I want to be able to just kind of even though it's an exam kind of take that opportunity as a performance a fun performance because I love performing performance even though it is what I want my career to be I still want it to be enjoyable it kind of sounds like I want to have my cake and eat it and just because I'm scared about this year doesn't mean this year is going to be bad if anything I think this year is going to be one of the best years for opportunity in my one of like one of the best years for opportunity in my entire life. Um, I just want to be able to make the most of that opportunity. Also, I just realised how weird I look because my glasses are so far down my nose. I'm really, really excited to meet the new people in my class because we have there's a plane going past. We have mixture of year 12 and year 13 in the same class, um, so we have new students and I'm so excited to meet them. Um, 
I want to make them feel as involved and as settled as the Year 13s did for us because um, the Year 13s last year are some of my best friends. Uh, and they made me feel really comfortable and really happy in the environment. So I'm hoping I can do the same to the Year 12 this year. I am really excited. I think it's going to be a good year. While I'm here, I'm going to pack my bag. Um, I don't actually have that much to pack, which is slightly concerning. I just literally have some pens, a couple of scripts, and that's basically it, which I don't know if I should be concerned about that or not. Oh, I'll be putting my pens in a pencil case. There's some just random stuff in here as well, just some random stationery that I don't even know if I'm going to use, but I will take it anyway. But that's literally all I've got, and I don't know if I should be concerned about that, but this is all I need. Most of my stuff's online anyway or singing <laughs> we don't actually have our timetables out yet which is a bit weird i'm a bit concerned about that um i don't know what i'm doing tomorrow i'm going to show up and pray basically i don't know what's going on they haven't given out our timetables they haven't told us anything but to be fair that's pretty consistent of what i've been doing this whole last year so I I wasn't really expecting anything different, just showing up and hoping for the best. But I feel like they should be telling us what's going on. I don't know, maybe that's my wishful thinking. But I wouldn't know where I'm going. I don't know what class I'm supposed to be in first tomorrow. We'll roll with it, we'll roll with it, it'll be fine. Right, anyway, I'm going to get this off my face um, so I don't look like a pomegranate anymore. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you're going back to school, I'm proud of you. Um, I love you. Take some time for yourself, as well as for focusing on your grades, because you matter way more than your grades ever will. Um, just, just factual information coming from me to you. Um, yeah, I really hope you have a good term, I really hope you have a good year, I really hope you have a good day, if you need to take it a day at a time, because I think we all need to do that sometimes. Um, yeah, remember to click the like button, subscribe, maybe leave a comment if you want, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.